Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create drama in the easiest way possible when you're out photographing your landscapes. 90% of my portfolio is built upon this filter and you guessed it, it is the 10 stop neutral density filter. Love the way the 10 stop ND smooths out the clouds, smooths out the water and provides that drama into an image at almost any time of the day, permitting that the conditions are favorable for using the filter. I still use this technique even with my self portraits and over 10 years I have built up a recognizable signature style just by using this one filter. Let's get into how to create your own. You cannot do this without a sturdy tripod, so I definitely recommend investing in one because it is going to make your life so much more easier when doing a long exposure. The first thing you want to do after you compose your scene is decide the aperture and the ISO that you're going to use. Since you're on a tripod, I definitely recommend using the lowest ISO possible. Once you have your settings dialed in, you then take these settings to a long exposure chart. You can find any sort of long exposure chart on the internet, an app. You simply enter in your settings of the exposed scene that you exposed for, and that will give you the long exposure time that you need to go for with your 10 stop ND filter. You then focus on the scene without the filter and then flip your lens into manual focus. Now you're ready to put on the filter and now that you have all of your settings sorted out, you dial that in and then you take the image for the recommended shutter speed time. I recommend using a remote to do this or simply putting on the two second self, self timer so that you do not have to touch your camera and create any camera shake that might make your image a little bit blurry. The exposure is complete, voila! You now have a moody, dramatic, and beautiful image all completed while using this simple filter. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. Please subscribe if you enjoyed this and found it helpful. And don't forget to go down to the description below and subscribe to my newsletter because this month I have my first ever editing tutorial coming out. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.